and our arms are above our heads. And when they do, you have to freeze in one of those shapes. Let me think, what could you do? Okay. Hello Key Stage 1 and welcome to the Home PE activity. Today we are going to be doing some gymnastics and dance together. You will need some sort of music in the background to help you go along with the activities and you'll also need a soft surface. If you are in school, then you can use a mat. However, if you're at home, a carpet or blanket will be absolutely fine. Safety. You'll need to be careful of your surroundings, so make sure you've got enough space that you won't be able to bump into anyone or anything around you. So remember, if you're at home, if you've got sofas or chairs, make sure that you've got enough space. Set up. Please find a space that will make sure that when your arms are out or your legs are out, you're not hitting anything or anyone. Okay, that's really, really important. And you also have to make sure that someone is there to press and play the music and you can do it whenever you need it. We are going to start off with a quick warm up for level one. So, first of all, we have five activities for you that are going to last 30 seconds. I'll go through them all quickly now for you before we can start. So, first of all, we've got star jumps. So we're going to start with our arms by our sides, legs together, and we're going to jump out into a star position, and then we're going to jump back to our first position. Okay, so we're just going to keep going like this. self-explanatory so we're just going to start running on the spot lifting our knees nice and high and our arms moving lovely 30 seconds off you go So this you will need some magical fingers, okay, because we're going to do some beans. So first of all, reach those magical fingers up into the air for the tall bean. So on our toes, then we're going to take those magical fingers down into a small bean. And then take those fingers out and do a wide bean. Lovely, 30 seconds, off you go.
level two. So we are going to be slowly moving around our area that we have, that is nice and safe for us to do so, and we are going to use the five exercises we've just used and use them in our space. I will give you a quick example. So we're going to take our star jumps and I'm going to star jump around the space and then I might turn around and I might do some running on the spot and going in and around all of that space. Try and come up with as many as possible. You have five minutes. Off you go.
was fantastic key stage one. We are now going to go on to level three, which we are going to learn all five basic gymnastic shapes. Remember, if you do get stuck at any time, make sure to ask a parent or a family member to help you read back through the lesson plan that will be online, okay? So, the first one we're going to do is a star. A star shape is similar to our star jumps where we're going to have our arms and legs wide apart, stretching, tall back, nice straight arms, and there we go. We are going to hold it for three seconds, so we're going to count for three elephants, okay? One elephant, two elephants, three elephants. Fantastic. Right, go away and practice that two more times and we'll get on to the next shape. Okay, fantastic everyone, well done with those star shapes. Now we are going to go on to our straight shape. So we are going to have our legs together and we're going to have our fingers and our arms above our heads and we're going to be on those tippy toes. Remember our arms are our headphones, we are going to have them against our ears and we're going to reach for the ceiling and if you can reach the ceiling, reach for that sky, see how high you can go. Lovely. Remember, hold it for three elephants and we'll come back after two more practices. Okay, fantastic. Well done. We are now going to go for a tuck. Okay, so what we are going to do is we're going to be on our tippy toes and we're going to come down onto our feet. We're going to have our legs together and we're going to bring our arms in and we're going to give our legs a big cuddle. And then our chin is going to come into our chest. I'll go side on so you can see from this way. So we're going to cuddle and chin in. Remember, three elephants. Two time practicing, off you go. Key stage one, you are doing amazing. We are now going to go onto our pike position, okay? So, we are going to have our bottoms on the floor, our legs out and our toes pointing towards that ceiling, okay? Make sure our knees are on the floor, we don't want them up in the air. Okay, so nice straight legs. You are then going to have a nice tall spine, like a giraffe, nice and tall, and you're gonna have your arms out, pointing towards your toes, head facing forwards. Lovely, hold up for three elephants and we'll be right back. Amazing, now we are going to go into our last shape, which is a straddle shape. Okay, so we're going to again sit on the floor, we're going to have our legs apart, okay, so we've got a triangle on the floor, okay, we are going to have our feet pointing towards the ceiling and we're going to have our arms pointing towards our feet, okay, looking forwards, counting those three elephants, off you go. Give yourselves a round of applause, Key Stage 1. We are now going to go away for five minutes and practice all of those shapes we have just learned. Remember, we have a star, we have a straight, we have a tuck, we have a pike, and we have a straddle. Remember, use your lesson plan if you need to see the pictures. They will be on page two, so make sure you can see them. Off you go.
stage one, we are now going to move on to level four. This is where we're going to start adding some of our dance to our gymnastics session. Okay, so I want you to travel around your safe space and I would like you to have music playing in the background. So make sure you have your family member ready to press play on that music. However, we've got a little trick. We are going to ask that parent if they can pause the music and when they do, you have to freeze in one of those shapes. Okay, so when the music is playing, you're going to be travelling around, you can either be walking, you can do, be doing our star jumps, you can be doing our running, you can be doing our twists, our jumps or our stretches and when the music stops, you freeze in a gymnastic shape. Do you all understand? Off you go.
Well done, I hope you enjoyed that level. We are now going to be moving on to level five. This is where you're gonna be traveling around the space with the music again. However, if the music is slow and calm, we're going to be doing our movements nice and slowly, okay? So you should be moving nice and slowly, okay? If the music is nice and speedy, we're gonna be doing it really, really fast and nice and fast for all of you at home, okay? So remember, if the music is slow, we're going to be nice and slow. If the music is really fast, we're gonna be doing it really fast. Five minutes, off you go.
stage one, we are on to level six. This time, you are going to travel around the space that is safe for you to do so, and you are going to be in your shapes. Let me think, what could you do? Okay, so we have a straddle position, and you could walk forwards. Can you try and do that now? And can you walk backwards? Could you walk from side to side? If you can, that is amazing. Let me think, what could be another shape that we could do? We could be in our straight position on the floor. So remember, our feet are together and our arms are above our heads. Headphone ears. And we could roll across the floor. Okay, lovely. That is my two shapes for you. Can you come up with any others? You have five minutes to do so. Off you go, everyone.
yourselves a round of applause. That is all six levels done now. We are going to be moving on to our games. So we have two games here for you now. So can you teach a family member the five shapes that we've just learned through this gymnastics and dance lesson? If you can, can you get them to copy and repeat you? Okay, so what you could do is do your shape towards them and then they have to copy you facing you. Okay, can you do all five? Give it a go.
done, that is really, really good. We are now going to move on to our last challenge, which I'm going to give you 10 minutes to do. You have learnt a lot of different movements and shapes throughout this lesson. Can you link them all together to make a routine? Okay, a routine is when you add all of them together so they link one after the other. If you are stuck, ask a family member or friend to help you or go back through our lessons provided and come up with an idea. Can you perform it to different styles of music? Could it be really fast? Could it be really slow? Could it be really big? Could it be really small? It is up to you, 10 minutes, off you go.
I am sure you've come up with some amazing routines there and hopefully when you come back to school you'll be able to show your sports member what you've created. We all look forward to seeing that. Okay, I would like to say a big thank you from me for taking part in this PE lesson today and remember to keep active at home. Go away now and get a drink of water and we look forward to seeing you very soon. Bye from me.